Hey guys, Megan here with Retrite. Um, I just wanted to kind of give you a quick walkthrough um, on using our Google Docs for your content. So um, I've sent you over your website, and so I've also given you a link to a Google Doc. So what this will do is kind of walk you through your entire website page by page, and then you can also um, type anything directly in here for us to use. So if you're not familiar with Google Docs, um, Google um, is a cloud-based, so it will automatically save. So there's you don't need to go up here and do file save. It automatically saves as you're typing, um, and um, the document is shared with me. So um, walking you through your site, uh, when it tells you here's your home page, um, you've got a background video, a welcome home uh, intro blurb, find connection blurb, upcoming events blurb, and your contact information. So what I'm wanting you to do is to use this to say, okay, here's my background video. I'm going to have one or not. Um, here's my welcome blurb. So this paragraph here, you're obviously welcome to keep or change or use whatever you want, but to get it to us um, so that our team can upload it for you, this is just an easier way um, where you can pretty much go in here and paste in um, your blurb. If you want to get fancy and help me out, you can change the text color. Um, that's totally up to you. Um, I'll obviously know uh, what's yours and what's mine. Um, so this is just, like I said, a helpful way to kind of walk you through everything um, to let you know what we're needing from you. Like I said, any of this content that's already here, if you want to keep it, then you can just write um, keep as is. Um, you could write delete. <laughs> Whatever you're wanting to say in here to get over to me is totally fine. If you have questions about some stuff, um, you can also write comments. Um, a lot of times if I'm coming back to you to ask you something, I will write as a comment in here. Um, and so it's going to highlight the area that I'm talking about. And then I can write something like, um, will you have a video? This is going to give you a comment to where you're going to look and see, oh, this is highlighted and you can um, reply. So it's not going to let me reply because I'm, oh, there you go. So then I can reply to myself. Okay, this should be you saying, yes, I will, or no, I won't. Um, and then once I've solved it, I'll either click resolve. But this is kind of an easier way for um, us to communicate together um, rather than email. Um, but like I've mentioned in um, my email to you, you are welcome to email. Of course, if you don't want to even use this Google document, um, you do not have to. Uh, I just found that this was kind of an easier and quick way um, to kind of let you see what do I need from you um, on every single page. And this kind of also keeps you on track. So that way you can see what you've worked on. Um, obviously, having content up, sometimes it gets a little confusing to say, is this yours? Is this our generic stuff? Um, so this just helps keep everything in line. Um, same thing with your contact information. It's just easier. Hey, if it's all in one spot, um, it'll help us out. And then obviously, even down here, you can add your social media links for us uh, so that we can link those into your footer. So hopefully uh, this was just a quick rundown on how to use this. Um, if you do uh, add any information to your Google document, it does not send me um, a notification. So even though it's shared with me, I do not get a notification. So it is helpful if you do use this, if you add anything to here, if you shoot me a quick email just to say, hey, I've uploaded some content on the Google Doc. Um, that way I'll know and that I can work on that for you. So anyway, thanks for watching.